Hello guys, what's up? Welcome to my channel, Day Shadi. So guys, in this video, I'll be showing how to make this burger design poster in Photoshop. Very simple in this step, guys. So if this is the first time you're watching me, please kindly hit the subscribe button and turn on the post notification bell. So without any further ado, let's start. So I'll title my design, burger flyer. Then I'll set my size to five by five inches. It's all set to remain the same. I'll press on create. The next thing I'll do is I'll grab my test tool. I'll choose this font. Break fast. Then I'll write burger. So I'll increase the size of my fonts. I'll double click on it to open the layer style menu. Then I'll come to gradient overlay. Then I apply these gradients. You can copy the gradient color codes. The next thing I'll do is I'll grab my rectangle too. Then I'll draw a rectangle. So I'll hold Alt and drag to make a copy of my rectangle. Then I'll change the color of my rectangle to this color. You can copy the color code. I'll right click on it, then I'll select Q. So I'll scale my rectangle more nicely like this. So I'll grab it my next image. Then I'll resize my image. I'll add a new layer to it. And I'll select my color to black. This layer on top of this layer. I will grab my select tool to fill transform it. I'll bring it down like this. So I'll right click on it, then I'll select flip vertical. So the next thing I'll do is I'll reduce the opacity to 93 or 95, any one you want. Then I'll add a layer marks to it. I'll grab my brush to set in foreground to black. Then I'll delete some portion. I'll link these two layers. Then I'll make a copy of them. So I'll drag the two layers beneath these new layers. I'll drag them and resize them like this.
then I'll turn these two layers on, the new layers. So you see that you get two beggars like this. So I'll come here, then I'll come to camera or filter. Follow what I'm doing. So I'll drag this matte filter onto the other layer by holding Alt and dragging it. So with the layer behind it selected, I'll come to filter and come to guardian blur. Then I'll do this. So I'll bring in my next image, which is this image. I'll bring in my next image, which is this tomato image. I'll grab my module tool, then I'll press Ctrl plus J. To make a copy of this one, I'll do the same to this layer. So I'll bring this layer behind the main beggar. I'll select this image. Come to Blair, then I'll do this. So I'll do the same for all my tomatoes. So I'll do the same for all my tomatoes. So the next thing I'll do is I'll grab my test tool. I'll 
chicken and rice, super delicious burger. And the super delicious, I'll uh, use these phones, hey teacher, and the burger, I'll uh, use these phones, bakery.